The first thing we need to do, we need to choose a stance that's comfortable for us. But the thing that needs to be in common amongst all those stances, our knees need to be inside our feet. Also, the back foot is the foot that's gonna be rotated. We need to make sure that that foot is exactly perpendicular or 90 degrees to the pitcher's mound. The next thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna take our negative move. Some people call it loading. Basically what happens during the negative move is we load our weight up on our back foot. Make sure that when we load up on our back foot with this weight, that we don't allow this knee to get over our back foot. We need to keep always our knees inside our feet. Our hands during the negative move goes back to a position slightly behind and about even with the shoulder. The next part of the, the swing is the stride. We can take no stride or we can take a stride, it doesn't matter, but whatever happens, we're going to get on the toe of our left foot, if we're a right-handed batter, our front foot, I should say. This is called toe touch. We're already loaded up and we're ready to go. We have toe touch. Heel plant, our left heel goes down and immediately, without the bat moving, our back knee starts to turn and we're turning on the inside of our foot. We want to turn on the inside of our foot so we can get our foot turned quickly to turn our hips quickly and get our shoelaces pointed towards the pitcher. When we start our bat towards the ball, we call this connection. We're connecting the upper part of the body with the lower part of the body, and we're starting to try to get our right palm up. We go, get to a position called bat lag, and that's, that's taking the knob of the ball directly to the plane or the height of the ball. When we get to bat lag, our back foot should be completely turned in perpendicular. We should be in a knee, knee behind knee position. At contact, we still want some flex left in our arms. We want the front leg locked so that we don't continue to travel forward and become a front foot hitter. After contact, we're gonna to throw to the bat to a point of extension. We call this extension. Extension. And then finally, we're gonna finish with our shoulders reversed, our chin on that shoulder, and our hands and the bat should be slightly above our shoulder.